Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome if you're here today. We're here at Bush Gardens Tampa for the very first time. Pretty excited. I'm over here with Ethan from the Atlanta Tours. Right. Uh, we're gonna ride some really awesome coasters. I'm excited for all of them, really. I know Guazi is the main one, but I'm excited to ride all the coasters and just get those on the coasters credits, you know what I'm saying? But um, it's gonna be a really fun day today. I think park closed at seven o'clock, so we don't got much time, but still gonna have a great, awesome time here at Bush Gardens today. So I'm gonna take y'all along with me. Let's do this thing. Something really cool about what you see so far. Sponsored by Coca-Cola. Gotta love it. And we're actually now gonna enter the park officially, and here's the site of one of the coasters. That's awesome. And also we have some American alligators. Oh yeah. That's my spirit animal if y'all know. And here comes Shoot Hunt. It actually just launched over there and it's gonna come over here very soon. Oh, you hear everything going on. This is actually pretty close. All right, here it goes. Whoa. They want the bridge right now, but here's another cool view at the launch. Wow. And I actually think we're going to Montu first. I think we're going to Montu, right? Oh yeah, Montu. But uh, this is actually part of Bush Gardens Howl Scream. I'm definitely excited to go to this year because I didn't go last year, but supposedly Bush Gardens is way better than SeaWorld. Actually walking by Cobra's Curse at 15 minutes. Sounds like a pretty awesome time. So we actually stopped. This is actually the uh, queue for Cobra's Curse. Hello. Um, it looks pretty cool inside of it so far. Uh, I did miss the beginning of the queue because I was putting some stuff in my fanny pack. And yes, I am wearing a fanny pack today. Best efficient way to come to the gardens. And we are now here at the loading station for Cobra's Curse. All right, guys, here we go. And we're about to go up this little elevator. Oh, yeah. Felt like Cosmic Rewind in 50 years. <laughs> spins, it goes backwards a little bit. Now we spin, free spin. Oh my gosh. Sometimes I don't, it's just, sometimes I just stay like one direction the whole ride. That was a good ride today. Definitely. That was pretty good. That was a good ride. Woo! That's that classic B&M sound, you hear it? Woo! So awesome. All right guys, Cobra Curse is good, but now we're going to do Montsu. It's a 10 minute wait. Pretty excited. All right, this is the queue for Monsoon. It's pretty neat. Here we go. Hold on with one hand on these, just so your head is Yeah, Got a feet dangling.
All right, guys, let's get off Montu and Cobra's Curse. Pretty good rides. Um, Montu is just like Batman in Six Flags Over Georgia. Um, has multiple clones just like that coaster. But man, that thing was hauling. That two minute long coaster it was really good. And coming up next, looks like we're gonna go to the Serengeti Flyers. It's actually a brand new attraction here at Busch Garden. So we're gonna see what it's all about. Basically it's a big old swing, but it's gonna be pretty awesome. And here it is, Serengeti Flyers. It is five minutes. I guess nobody wants to go on a big old swing. All right, here we go, guys. Serengeti Flyer. All right, Ethan, so tell us a little bit about this Serengeti is Flyers. This tallest screaming swing. Serengeti Flyers, 135 feet tall, and it goes 16 miles an hour. Woo! Wow, this starts right off, doesn't it? Oh. Great. No, 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 little swing. Ethan, it's like going to the park. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh Except oh, the big oh. part. Oh, my gosh. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Oh my gosh. Hey, 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 look above your head. Oh my gosh. Crazy, crazy till we get to the Yeah, guys, that was something else. Like, for a second, we were going upside down. I was like, oh, my stomach. And here's another look at it. Whew, that was intense. Like, it's kind of hard to tell on film, but man. And here it goes, guys. The swinging begins. We were on the left side, by the way. Good Lord. Wow, look at that thing. You're swinging for a good bit. I can't believe I did that. Oh my gosh. Wow. I don't know what's the worst part, looking down or when you're up like that, going backwards. <laughs> That's not really, I'm not gonna really say a worst part, but a um, more intense part, I like to say. So a couple of them at Busch Gardens is happening right now. Um, Kumba, I think it's had its 30th anniversary. Falcon's Fury just reopened. And all, oh, that was Falcon's Fury, it's loud. And also doing a food and wine festival. So we've got a couple things going on right now. So over here at Falcon's Fury, they have a lot of good stuff here, like some food, some shops, and of course, Falcon's Fury itself. A lot of stuff over here. And Falcon's Fury is at a five minute wait. All right, guys, so we are about to board Falcon's Fury. There it is. Wow. So it goes up and it tilts forward and drops you. Yeah, that's pretty high up there. There it goes. Oh my god. Dear Lord. Alright guys, we're about to go into the air. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Goodbye, Earthlands. There's and we have Gwazi. Gwazi. So it's beautiful. Look at Gwazi going. She's amazing. Oh, yeah. Oh, you can see the city of Tampa from over here. <laughs> oh, why are we. Gwazi's no, 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 no. We are really high in the air. I wish we were facing Serengeti. Oh, yeah. Here's about to pop. We got Scorpion down there. My ears popped. <laughs> Deeker looks amazing from this angle. Holy cow. Are you just talking not to make you nervous? <laughs> no, no, no. That's the team member parking. The view is amazing. Oh my gosh. We're looking down. Holy. Oh, you're about to drop? Oh. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. 
I lost half my stomach, okay? It's amazing. <laughs> that was crazy, guys. Pretty crazy. The next one to do Scorpion. Doesn't look that bad. It's more one of the older coasters, but still looks really awesome. All right, guys. Front row on Scorpion. So that was a pretty fun ride on uh, the Scorpion. I would probably say the best part is definitely like right in the beginning, like you don't expect it. Like you know it's gonna happen because you see it, but um, it's pretty fun to loop around and also riding and like you go so close to the ground. It's pretty fun. So Ethan's actually getting back on Falcon's Ferry, but let's go kind of explore just a little bit and slow down. They actually have a pretty cool little uh, restaurant here called the Dragon Fire. Looks pretty cool. Goodbye, friend. And there goes Ethan, way up in the sky. I think it's 375 feet in the air. Oh yeah, you hang it. Oh my. <laughs> so the Sand Serpent is actually closed today and it actually had like a swinging boat ride here. So what Ethan's telling me, the uh, rumor they're going to close this as well and make like a big old like Raptor RMC. We'll see though. And check this out, the Pantopia Theater. They do some kind of like shows here and stuff. Looks pretty cool. And as we're on the way to Kumba, check out this little bridge. It has some misters down here. It's really nice. And here are the Kumba 30th anniversary past member pins. Looks pretty awesome. So even though I'm not a past member here at Bush Gardens, the uh, team member right here at the table, he was really cool. He was like, hey, you want one? I was like, yeah, sure. So I got myself a 30th anniversary Kuma button. Pretty awesome. And the track is actually really wide. Like, check that out. Whew. And here is the queue. I guess on a really busy day, this day can be really filled up. But it's like a five minute wait, they told us. And we are about to load. Oh, that's awesome right there. Here we go. Look at that. Oh yeah. It's like an S-curve. Oh boy.
guess Hagrid's is awesome, uh, Guardians is awesome, but as far as intense goes, like, that was pretty intense. Like, you really feel it. Like, it was hauling butts. Like, it's pretty awesome. So we actually made our way over towards this other bridge. Um, down there is actually the Congo River Rapids. Looks pretty fun, but here's another spot to see Kumba. That's awesome. And to explore park a little more, we have a Chick-fil-A here at Bush Gardens. This is actually the first Chick-fil-A I've ever seen in a theme park. It's pretty awesome. The price is probably a little bit more than a regular Chick-fil-A, but hey, it's sweet. And now coming up next is Tigress. 15 minute wait. Doesn't seem too bad. All right, we now made it to the load stations here at Tigress. Last row. Come backwards. And it's gonna come down very fast. Woo. That's awesome. Here we go, guys. Okay guys, Tigress was actually pretty fun. It is a pretty short ride, but they're less fun. Um, actually just turned four years old as well. And come over here is Shikra. I think it looks down for the moment. Um, it was testing a little bit ago, but it may not be open today. And just like that, Shikra is now back open. Hope it doesn't go down. All right guys, here we go. We actually in the center, in the front. Check how wide that track is. Check it out, look Alright guys, that was pretty fun. It doesn't look like in a film like that high, but like when you're up there, you are up there. Like you can see the city of Tampa, like it's pretty amazing. And there is that drop. Wow. Here I think horror. And come on next, we're gonna see what's going on with the Bush Gardens Food and Wine Festival. Let's see what it has to offer. All right, guys, we're now over here in this facility, we have like all like food and wine stuff, your drinks, your food. They also have like a little like a uh, canopy amphitheater, has some shows. Cool. And also, look at this. Oh, is that say the Coke Canopy? Wow. 
I respect that. This is called Latin Twist Chimichurri Beef Skewer. They have a Mojo Pork Taco and a Pina Colada Triple. Interesting. In honor, Hitchcock would be proud. That's Adu inspired. Yeah. All right, so me and Ethan both got these pork tacos and I got like chimichurri sauce. So we're gonna see how it is. All right, guys, you see that drip? Thank you guys so much once again. My name is Devin. Okay. That chimichurri sauce is pretty good. Um, I was expecting like the pork to be like a little like more warm, but it's actually hot. It's good. Alright guys, that pork taco was actually pretty good. That, that sauce, like, you saw that drip. That was probably like the best thing I saw on the menu, like out of all the booths. And obviously it's the only thing I tried, but it was pretty good. And right here, they do have a little uh, display of all of the festivals here at Bush Gardens. And also here is called the Cupcake Corner. They have cupcake themed to all the coasters over here. Tigress, Cheetah Hunt, Quasi, and Chikra. And we're now in front of Iron Quasi. A 30 minute wait. All right guys, here is Iron Quasi. Wow, that's an awesome track. This is the second RMC I have also ever been on. All right, we are now about to board Iron Gwazi for the very first time. All right, guys, now boarding Gwazi. All right, guys, here we go. What a ride. All right, guys, so we actually just got off Iron Guazi. You saw it. What an incredible ride. We're going to talk about it later on in the end of the vlog, but next up is Cheetah Hunt, the final ride of the day. We also have seven minutes left at the park. It closes at seven o'clock, so should be able to do it. It's like right over here. And here we go Cheetah Hunt, 25 minute wait. Also, this is like Hagrid's daddy, if you didn't know. Goodbye. Here we go, guys. Last ride of the day, Cheetah Hunt.
and now it is time to exit the park. Closed about 20 minutes ago. Also, I'm gonna show this early, but before you actually enter the park, here are the height requirements right outside. All right, guys, that will do it here for today, here at Bush Gardens, Tampa. All right, guys, what a great time here at Bush Gardens, Tampa. Um, for my very first time as well, knocking these coasters out. I thought it was a really great day. Um, I do want to come again just to have like a more chill day and also a longer day as well, because um, the park closes at seven o'clock. That's pretty early for a park. Um, but anyways, I had a really great time. Personally, my favorite coasters is um, Cheetah Hunt, Wazi, and Kumba. Those are the, my favorite coasters. And honestly, I think I like Cheetah Hunt better than Gwazi, but uh, Gwazi is still an awesome coaster. Um, every coaster here is awesome. And um, you really can't compare to like POVs on YouTube. You just gotta experience it for yourself if you can. They're really great. And um, the only con I really have to say for today is like things like kind of scattered around than like areas at a park. But other than that, I really had a great time here at Bush Gardens. Nothing really negative to say at right now. Um, the biggest wait was Gwazi today, like 25, 30 minutes, and that was really it. Um, but anyways, hope y'all enjoyed this video. And if you did enjoy this video, make sure to big old thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more future content because I'm gonna be uploading all the POVs for this video separate later on as the days go on. Um, but I will see you guys next one. Thank you so much for watching. And remember, the adventure is out there.